How are you all doing? Oh, I'm relaxing on this fantastic raised bed that I'm building. Oh yeah, you gotta love it. It's really comfortable. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna show you what I've built, so uh, don't go away. Well, my friends, um, this is the first ever raised bed that I've built, and I would like to know what you all think. I mean, am I doing it right? <laughs> it's the first time I do this, so. so let's come a bit closer. So, of course, the bed is not finished yet, so I need to continue laying logs. Along, I think I need about uh, twice as many, twice as many logs, so like, again, another good part like that. Then what I'm going to do is, I'm going to leave approximately here a gap, an empty space, and then continue building that way, so that I can kind of sit on this side, and then I would have a table going that way. That's the idea of it anyway. So let's see what I've done. Now, I'm using this white rope, um, which I've tested uh, before. Actually, I usually use this rope because it's cheap and it holds on really well. There we go. So what I've done is I've tied the logs on that one around the tree. Then, oops, I don't want to fall. Try not to anyway. Yeah, and I've done the same on this side, as you can see there. Now, uh, it's really tight. Um, and I suppose it will hold, for a while at least. I've just been lying on it, as you saw, and uh, rather comfortable. Now, this side, I've done the same thing. There you go. I've used uh, 20 meters of rope here, and 20 meters of rope there. Now, I use this cheap rope also because uh, I'm going to leave it here of course and if anybody takes it it won't be such a big loss. So it's alright because the idea of building this was to make a, a semi-permanent shelter. For now I'm doing the bed, then later I don't know if I'm going to build a lean-to or I'm just going to leave everything ready so I just bring a top and cover it when I get here every time, so... Okay, now, a very important thing I've done, because I'm very heavy uh, and I don't trust rope, <laughs> so what I've done is I've put logs also to support these logs. So we've got one here tied with a rope so it won't move. And then I've got another one here, tied to the, to the tree. And, of course, got the same here and here. I might even put another in the middle, even though it holds my weight really well, but... Now the length of this bed is really, really long. Much longer than what you would normally build. But that's because, as I said, I want to leave... Oops, let me... But that's because, as I said, I want to leave the gap and make a table and everything will be under a top or a lean-to made of wood and leaves and that, I'm still not sure. I mean, with this ground, not many leaves. It's mostly a pine needles, which, you know, won't, I don't think will hold really well to the, to the lean-to to make a, a roof. So... Yeah, as I was saying, the length of this is uh, three meters, three and a half meters, I think. Uh, plenty of space, lots of work. Now, I'm going to be honest, I did, um, I made a video, and actually I started making this bed last week, so a week ago. And, um, but I, I had it too high, and even though I made the video, I was not happy with it. So that's why I'm not going to post that video, I'm going to post this one, because I've lowered it. Now I cannot come much lower than, uh, than that 
on that side because it's going to be on the floor and that's not what I want. Now the ground is uneven, as you can see it's going down, but the bed is as straight as I could get it. Now when I wake up in the morning, this is the view that I'm going to have. Look at that, there's like a little valley going down with hills on the other side. I got plenty of uh, little pine trees so I can make uh, pine needle tea. Now I'm a bit concerned that maybe because I'm on the top of, uh, of a hill I'm going to get quite a bit of wind coming from down there. I don't know how bad that will be, I still need to check. That's my jacket. By the way, it's not anybody hiding there. It looked like that. It looked like there was somebody hiding there. <laughs> but no. I'm all alone. Look at all the wood I have lying around. Lots of uh, building uh, materials that I can use. So, okay, my friends. That's what I've been doing all day. Building my shelter. Well, the bed for now. And uh, I don't know, tell me what you think. Leave a comment. Uh, I always uh, love answering your, your comments. And, uh, you know, like, subscribe if you like to see more. Okay, my friends, I'm running out of light uh, and I need to pack. And actually, I'll wait until it gets dark and then I'll hike out. But for now, and until the next one, Thanks for watching and God bless.